With Reaper, it is possible to work with video, to make voiceovers and simple edits with crossfades, titles and some effects. To make this possible, let's see how to do it in this video. <laughs> Reaper is a tool that allows you not only to produce music, but also to work in ADR and to perform simple video editing with crossfade effects, titles and so on. To enable these features, you need to install two free packages, VLC and the FFmpeg. VLC can be found for all platforms on the videoland.org site, whose link is down below in the description box. After installing VLC, you need to download FFmpeg Type Share version 4.1.3. There are more recent versions, but they give problems in exporting audio to AAC and MP3 when associated with video. The website from which to download it, declared in the videos of Kenny Joya and John Tidy, sadly ceased to exist in the middle of 20. 20 ever since. I then recovered the packages and made them available for all platforms on my GitHub account. The link can be found down below in the description box. For this video, I will be using the Windows 64 version. The operations are identical for all the other platforms. Indeed, I made the packages available both for the Windows 64 and 32 bit version and Mac OS 64 bit. Once you have downloaded the package that interests you, start Reaper. Click on Options. Show Reaper Resource Path in Explorer Finder. Go to the directory User Plugins. From the zip file downloaded from GitHub, go to the bin directory and drag all the files to User Plugins and drop them up there. It shouldn't be required, however, restart Reaper and drag a video into the project. Click on View, Video or Control Command plus Shift plus V and the video display opens. When to play, you will watch the video and listen to the audio. You can start editing. That's it for the moment. Thanks for watching.